see how unnatural the colors on your lures are and all of those things come into play so we've always said when you're fishing in the middle of the day when the big fish are active you need to get very realistic and you need to have natural motion natural look natural action and you need to to be quiet you need to turn that trolling motor down to a very low steady speed you need to turn that depth sounder off all the signs that are us need to go away you know if you're sitting in one place instead of holding with a trolling motor anchor you know the fish forget you're there you're not putting commotion in the water at night these rules change okay because bass under the cloak of darkness have a lot more security they they don't feel as threatened they don't feel as visible and and so when fish are savvy which most of them are in most of the waters we fish night fishing can be productive simply because it covers up our errors and it makes it easier for us to fool the bass because the bass don't have as good a look at it and you have to also understand that bass have expectations when they strike something during the day and they got really good visual acuity they they want to see it they want to reinforce it at night they're more apt to say well I can't really see that thing there's some activity there and they accept it for what it is before that's converted to anything really totally natural they'll just strike at action you also have to realize that they don't see uh, things like color our color vision goes down at night you know so and, and you'll see it when you walk out at night you don't see especially the reds that's the first thing to drop out and the last thing is the blues so you know moonlight looks kind of bluish to us and colors go away we don't see the green and trees you know you think about it they're just black so the best color you can have is black because it's the strongest color you know because it creates the darkest most contrast thing because there is light even on a starlit sky there's a slight gray you know you'll reel your lure in and you'll pick it up to see how far it's hanging off the end of your rod to cast it again and what do you do you hold that up to the sky and you can almost always see it so if you if you uh, realize that fish can't see color you need to make the strongest presentation to them which is black okay and you also need to strike yourself into areas where fish can see better you know if you if you've got dock lights on a dock one, it usually indicates that people are out there fishing, so they got feeders and brush piles off their dock, but it also gives you the, the sense that bass can see into that world, and if they back off into the dark, because the light has very limited penetration, then they can look into the light and they can feed. Also, light-colored boathouses and docks that are often painted white will strike up in a little bit of moonlight a great big like a drive-in movie screen that fish can silhouette against so you know you look for the cover that's next to those things and very often if you really think dark and you think of how you can see at night and look at the things that you can see and it really becomes quite simple we see a lot less in the dark so find the things you can see and and fish around them and you'll be fishing where the big fish are if you've enjoyed today's edition as much as I have being here for you, then don't forget, click on that button and send this to a friend.